up my love bugs and love muffins. It's Mama Love on a Sunday evening. And I'm sitting here and this is what I'm having. And I thought that I would chit chat with you guys. But I want to show you something. Delicious salad. I got cucumbers and red onions and tomatoes with uh, olive oil and vinegar dressing with uh, the, spring mix, the spring mix and spinach. And I'm having a cup of decaf coffee. And these, y'all, I wanted to tell y'all about these. Are the bomb.com. My friend hooked me up with these. These gave me life. And they said, when you get hungry, I'm sorry, this here. They said, when you get hungry at night, don't eat after a certain time. And if you're going to eat something, let it be a piece of fruit, a vegetable. My chair sliding away from me. Uh, a vegetable or something like that. Um, or a handful of peanuts. Me, I usually do peanuts. Cause peanuts are so good, y'all. Yeah. And I got broiled salmon in the oven. I mean, in the uh, broiler. I'm broiling salmon. So I'm eating my salad before I eat my with my salmon. But that's alright. Because I'm hungry. Anyway. Y'all gotta try this up. I usually didn't think I could live without cheese, but I can. Anyway, it's probably look. It's the mixed nut bar. Mm. And I think it's got sesame, peanuts, um, maybe dates. Got some other stuff in here, but it's 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 coated with honey, whatever. It is so healthy, y'all. I'm gonna be ready this spring. If I'm not ready by the spring, I'm gonna be looking good in the spring. But I definitely plan on being uh, looking nice for the summer and, and going back into the fall. Um, so I gotta make my confessions to y'all. Gotta be up front, don't wanna hide nothing from you. I stopped at Church's Chicken yesterday and I ate a two piece. And what tops it off is, it wasn't white meat, it was dark meat. And she asked me, did I want the snack or just the two pieces of chicken? And I said, I just want the two pieces of chicken. She put the biscuit in there, y'all. She put the biscuit in there, okay. I ate the biscuit. Yes, I did. I severed the biscuit. I am not going to lie to you all. So my day consisted yesterday of, it started out with uh, baked salmon, broccoli and green beans, and a Power Bowl burrito. Power Bowl burrito was 450 calories. That's the one at Taco Bell. I don't know what possessed me, y'all, to drive by Church's Chicken and bite into that two-piece, but I just had to taste it, you know? I mean, I was dodging Popeyes and Bojangles and KFC, which is not really a, uh, uh, it's not enticing to me, KFC, but Bojangles and Popeyes, Popeyes being my number one, yeah. Uh, but I hadn't had churches since I was with my mom back in Michigan, like two years ago, I had churches. We stopped at churches. That was the spot now before Popeyes was close, close by. That's my broiler to the stove. But. Oh, finally got the batteries. I don't hear nothing in the background talking about some low battery. Yeah, I went and got batteries and put them all over the house. But Anyway, y'all, I had to have it. I had to have that piece of chicken, two piece. I got that chicken, y'all. That chicken was like so piping hot. I didn't get a drink with it or nothing. <clears throat> I should have. I swallowed that, uh, that, that chicken. It was burning going down my esophagus. I thought I was gonna have to pull over. I started panicking. That's what I get. So, but I bounced back. 
I got my salmon in the oven today because I'm like, no, Reva, you didn't come this far. You can keep going. <coughs> and that's what I'm doing. Thank y'all for the compliments. Y'all say, oh, my mother, you looking smaller. Your face looking slimmer. I know I see it. I feel good. Uh, my knees are feeling better when I walk. Like I said, I tried them heels on. Last Sunday, boo. Them wedges. Couldn't tell us just enough, okay? It's on. I say it's on like a pot of neck bone. Anyway, think about heading to Michigan. But I want to stick around. I'm not going to leave town until I find out that my daughter Queen is in good standards. Her and my grandchild going to be healthy. Everything's going to be all right in the name of Jesus. I know it is, but I'm still going to be there. It's a must. I wouldn't be a mother if I wasn't. So. And then I gotta hit Michigan, y'all. I'm, I, I, I'm telling y'all. Somebody said once you travel and stuff, you'll get used to um, home and then you'll stay home. I don't know. Like I said, um, I got to get back to Michigan. You know. And I'm, I'm thinking about uh, 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 one of my friends had uh, called me and um, he was telling me to, you know, Reva, maybe you should keep your place in Atlanta and get a place in Michigan, just like something like a condo or an apartment. You ain't got to get like a house. So that way you could travel back and forth because people at home may make you mad. And then you'd be wishing that you never came back here. Well, people can make you mad from a distance, you know. But at the same time, it made a lot of sense because a lot of be jumping in Atlanta. You know, a lot be jumping in Atlanta in the summer. And um, I may, I may, I may do that. You know, um, I, I um, y'all all right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So I might, I might do that. You know, look into that. Whatever. And then I can bring friends back with me, y'all. Like, come on, y'all, let's go to Atlanta. You know, they go, you know, two weeks or something. However long it's there, and then head back home because, like I said, I love Michigan. I love my state. I, I don't care. It's beautiful outside right now. The sun is out. Um, it's a little, it's chilly. It's chilly, but it's not like Michigan with the snow. But still on yet though. If I was headed back home, I got my big triple down goose coat in the back. I know how to slip that mug on with them boots I got. I know how to get used to it. Get with it, baby. Get with the program. Mm. This salad is so good, y'all. This reminds me of the salad. That uh, mm. Mm. don't just look like that salad she was eating in Diary of a Mad Black Woman. <laughs> You're a little tramp. <laughs> Your little tramp ran off and left you high and dry. And then she pushed the plate of food. You're like, you want something to eat? Go in the kitchen and fix it yourself. Yeah, like that dry salad was so good. I'll be mad if it was some mac and cheese and greens and yams and dressing, fried chicken. Then we be then we then we have to fight. But yeah, mm -hmm. I just want to talk to y'all. Um, what I'm doing today, I had to share a little something with y'all. Thank you all. Thank you. Um, what's my countdown? Hold on. I really can't go by a countdown because I thank you all that I'm at almost a hundred thousand subscribers. Where am I at this point right now? I am at nine ninety nine thousand four hundred and seventy four subscribers at five forty. To God be the glory. 
for the things that he has done. I asked the Lord, I said, Lord, be consistent with this, this channel, like grow my channel for me, Lord. Let me be able to reach people, God, in your name. Let me be able to inspire somebody, Lord God. Let me use my platform to uplift you, Lord God. And you take my channel where it go. Because my views was like, y'all see the views. When I talk about the Lord, them views is, you know, kind of low. But they, but I appreciate 4,000 4, to maybe 7,000 views. I appreciate that, you know what I'm saying? Versus when I'm talking about other things. There you go, skyrocket, you know, one of the kids. I know y'all love the family. I know y'all love for me to, you know, cook, cook in videos. And I'm gonna continue to do those. Um, I know y'all love when I'm with the kids and stuff and y'all get to see, you know, what the kids is up to and everything. <gasps> Sharing my life with you all and um, things like that. Um, every video that I make though, I, I intend for it to be a good video and I try to give good content when I am with my kids. However, it does bother me though when I put my all into it and then out of everything inside of a video, the most smallest thing could be taken from it and made a big giant negative to where the beauty of the video was just destroyed. That's the only thing that bothers me, you know. But I look and say, you know, they ain't nothing but the enemy. So I just you know ignore it and keep on going you know but yeah i'm i'm learning that's life it's gonna be like that i'm not gonna lie and tell y'all that uh i don't want no juicy crab because i do i want me that cane crab with that broiled sh with that shrimp and that and that red skin potato and that and that corn on the cob sitting inside. Man, that boiled hot bag of butter and Cajun seasoning. Don't make no sense right now. Although I know I can have that. No. But it's just the fact that all that Cajun seasoning and stuff that is sitting in. But I imagine if I was to make that my only meal for the day, I can get away with it. Mm. I don't know y'all. Anyway, like I said, I'll be heading back to Michigan. After I find out, clean is set. Cause me and my brother gotta go discuss business. I love my brother. My I got three brothers. The oldest one is just one year older. Me and him got real close over the months. We had uh, had our differences in the past, whatever. But we had made amends with each other. Me and my brother used to be so close, y'all. And we just we just trying to get that time back. You know, I'm never gonna get the time back. But you could take off where you you know. From here, it starts. And pray to God for redemption. Pray to God that he redeemed the time, you know, for me and my brother, and that he keep us safe and healthy. He's doing the same thing too. Him and his wife been doing stir fries and eating good. They really encouraged me. I called on my FaceTime the other day. He was at Planet Fitness too, you know. Um, got to Planet Fitness yesterday, y'all, and they closed at seven. I ain't never seen such. I was so upset. Mm -mm. It's not even nine o'clock. Mm. That's why I'm gonna go during the week where it's 24 seven, no 24 hours during the week. But I guess I just walked around Walmart. Mm -mm. What's up Tina baby, you all right? My Tina just sitting over at the table y'all looking over at her mama. You all right, poopy poo? Her homesick? Huh? Oh, she waiting on me to take her to the store. I'm gonna take my baby to the store. After I whip down the corner of the setup. Want some coffee? Yeah. 
So I just wanted to holler at y'all and tell y'all how my day was going and confession of what I did yesterday about the pieces of chicken. And once I got that chicken, y'all created that chicken for the longest. But once I got it, guess what? It wasn't even all of that. Temptation a trip, y'all. You know, temptation to have you wanting something so bad. I'm going somewhere with this. Temptation will have you going, wanting something so bad. The devil can blow it up, make it look all good and voluptuous and enticing. Oh, you just, oh my God, you're just craving it and you're lusting it and all that. And then when you finally fall and get a hold of it, it wasn't even nothing. It wasn't even nothing to it. The whole point of the matter was to get you to fall. I'm going to leave on that note. Peace out in Jesus' name.